Hey, what's up, y'all? <laughs> uh -huh. uh, welcome back to the channel. Welcome me back, because it's been like two weeks since I put anything on this freaking channel. Oh, Keisha, she's gonna feel me. Then as I haven't been feeling like making a video because I just have not felt like filming myself anymore um, with the tripod and like all this stuff um, due to the laziness. So, so I got I gotta do this. I need to make reaction videos. I need to make the gaming videos. I've been more busy on my Twitch channel at twitchtv slash Aftermath. Make sure you follow that channel. Link in the description. Uh, with the big blue faces, you know what I'm saying. Y'all gotta come into the Twitch channel with the big blue faces. Right, we're gonna get this athletic workout in, in the gym, at home. I'm gonna try to use as little as equipment as possible for you guys to do this exercise, um, exercises. And, um... <laughs> she don't wanna be in a video because she already looks like Aunt Jemima. Right. <laughs> Now she's cutie. He's cute. Get the fuck off my big jerky! I bought it. Fail early, fail often, fail forward. Practice. Practice is controlled failure. You're getting to your limit, getting to your limit, getting to your limit. You can't lift that. You can't do that. You, until you get to the point that all of a sudden your body makes the adjustment and then you can do it. So fail early, fail often, fail forward. Don't Look at the skies. Look at that. That's a that's a that's a, that's a Nietzsche's window because he's smoking weed. It smells like cereal and weed in his room. All right, so check this out. First off, this video I gotta get. If y'all wanna see a skating video, some Jet Set Radio, yo, we gotta get 2,000 likes, bro. And I'm putting on these bad boys right here. 2K likes. Putting on these. We're gonna go to the skate park. You already know, big baby blue faces. You feel me? On the skates with the ones and twos, call me beat. You feel me? I'm, I'm no gear. Straight raw. Like everything else I do. Raw. You feel me? You feel me? Raw. I cut myself on the face. Raw. Straight raw. All right? USDA premium meat. But anyways, gotta get loose. Loose. All right, so uh, jump rope, dumbbells, you know, something to put your feet on uh, for some box, you know, some, some uh, single leg stuff. Uh, we'll be doing some jumping with the jump ropes, without the jump ropes, and with the dumbbells. Focus on a lot of explosiveness. Uh, we're doing a full body. If you have a kettlebell, I'm gonna add that in. I'm gonna add a few things in uh, for everybody. Do what you can do. If you don't have the equipment, then you can find something else to do. You know, you don't have to have a kettlebell. Like, you can use a dumbbell, you know, for snatches or things like that. Uh, but, like I said, let's get this started. Let me move the car for you guys. I got my keys. You got my keys? No, I the keys. You trying to watch the neighbor's car? Yeah, because it's just sitting there. At least I'm going to, you know, get the webs and stuff up. I enjoy washing car when I'm not tired. You know? Grab this joint. It's called Chop Fit. It's a an axe, a weighted axe for ab movements. Ugh, ugh, ugh. I feel like Wolverine already. Ugh. Okay. I'm gonna start warming up. I do 100 rotations with the jump rope to start off every workout that I do from home. So 100 rotations with the jump rope, and then I take lap right after, down the street, and back, okay? Okay, what it is, three times. 100 reps, down the street, and back. Everybody has a down the street, everybody. So there should be no reason you should not be doing this. If you don't have a jump rope, find a line. One, two, three, four, five, six. If you wanna make it harder, do single leg. 
two, three, four, five, six. Simple as that. You can do front and back. Easy. Side to side, front to back. Or you can do one leg at a time, 25. Switch, 25. Switch, 25. Switch, 25. 100 reps. And then haul ass down the block and back. Five second break and then right back to it. This time I'm gonna do the line jumps. The leg, left and right, both feet. Uh, you're gonna do your right foot and your left foot. Then we're gonna do forward, right and left foot. 25 reps each leg. Let's go. Tired, tired, tired of me. You got a cut on your face. To show off my manliness. Yeah. So, I know somebody got bands. I know one of y'all do. Somebody out there. All right, we've got abduction going on. Get abducted. 15 reps, four sets, all the way out. One, two, three, four, five. Don't keep, try to keep it stretched the whole time. Don't bring it all the way in and go out. Keep it like, still out. Six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Relax, keep the abs tight. Shake your head. Plorithia, it will be a word one day. Two, one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Ah! Whoo! All right. Let's move to the dumbbells, I mean kettlebells. Kettlebell setups. We're gonna get this weighted movement out of the way first, and then we'll go to the plyometric explosive movements, all right? I've talked about this before, the contrast training. Start with the weighted movement first, and then come down, use that, that euphoric feeling of lightness from dealing with weight into the explosive movements. We wanna move as fast as possible. So, that being said, kettlebells. So I'm gonna take it a step further for you guys. Instead of just regular kettlebell swings, which I'm still gonna engage my glutes, we're gonna do a full explosion. I'm gonna do snatches, right? Instead of eight reps, I'm gonna go six reps, each arm for the 80 pound kettlebell snatches. So, ready? <laughs> Six. 
I ain't got chalk, but I got that gamer goo, you know what I'm saying? For when shit gets sweaty, you feel me? So it's probably gonna work just as good. Smells good too. Smell that, smell that, smell that, smell that, smell that. Mm, mm, smell like greatness, right? I mean, I mean, It's that Taekwondo wood right there. Taekwondo wood. Yeah, I gotta work on my hips. <laughs> that kind of hurt. Oh my, I think I'm stretching my, my bicep by a little bit right now. So I need to build back up to this 80 pound snatch. So we'll do 12 reps, four sets, Kettlebell, swings, squeezing the glutes. We're squeezing the, the glutes hard. Penny pinchers. We want to do some penny pinchers, okay? So we're going straight into it. Three, two, one. Two, three, four, five. Squeeze my butt so hard, my back cracked. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what? Actually, I'd rather jump from this side. Oh, don't get hit by a car. <laughs> it's the hill that go down. See? That's a lot easier. So come back to the snatches. I just went to a lower weight right here. So we'll do 10 reps each arm instead of the six that I had initially for the 80 pounds. You guys are enjoying this workout make sure you like 2k likes we'll get those skates on got a skate park right down the street and i'll get to shredding shredding Shred. I'm, I'm about to go i'm about to go auto rocket on that shit auto wiggity 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 <laughs> give me some give me some <laughs> <laughs> so now we're going to move on to dumbbell we got clean and press with the jump. So, boom, one, two. What you wanna do, don't lock out those arms. Lock them out at the top. And as you feel yourself coming down, the weight needs to sink together with how your body's coming down. All right, so I don't want you to be like, you know what I'm saying? Cause then, ah shit, I got sweat in my eyes. Cause you can really injure your shoulders doing this. So start with the light weight. When doing this, we got five reps. Five reps, and then we have five more reps without the weight of maximum jump. So, it's gonna be like this. Front load. One, two, three, four. Burning. 
My knee still hurts from that uh, bowling accident I had. So it's hard to really push it. Bowling. Out of from all bowling. Out of all the shit I do, bowling. I'm gonna do a single leg at a time. Then one of the single leg jumps. Six reps. burning that sweat so we're gonna do three sets of this and then finish off with 50 50 frog squats that's the it's talking about some ants and there's a one time yo in arkansas malvern arkansas bro it's where my, like, my family is my mom's side go to my aunt house she got these she had this little canister of nuts and shit so i was like ooh, you know little eight-year-old me Nuts! Can I have some? My grandma auntie was like, go on, baby, you can have some nuts. So I was like, okay. And then the cartoon, one of my favorite cartoons, was on TV. So I wasn't paying attention to the inside of the nuts. So I uh, grab the nuts, I'm looking at the TV, open the nuts, boom. Eat. Start munching. Next thing you know, I start feeling some crawling on my hands. So I was like, like I was like, so I was like looking around on the floor, cause I had my hand on the floor. I was like, I looked at the area where my hand is, I didn't see nothing there. So I'm like, all right, bet. So I then, I looked at my hand, and I saw these little like termites on my hand, and I looked in the fucking peanut can, yo. It was full of termites. Oh. It was full of termites. So I ate a fistful of nuts and termites. I ate a fistful of termite nuts. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, so that, that that scarred me for like that, like that scarred me. So every time I open anything, bro, I gotta I like looking at joint. Turn my nuts. Turn my nuts. But hey, that's mo that's all motivation for this right here. The termite nuts made me who I am today as a termite nuts man. Okay. You some extra protein. I know. No, well, they do be eating termites and stuff for extra protein in the wild and stuff. Yeah. And I be seeing them with the little stick. They stick it in, and they eat them joints. Some protein. Ah, yo, the sweat be burning them eyes, bro. I hate that. <laughs> Good lord. Let's go. I just realized I could have did these with the 80s. Or just me being lazy. Make up for it. One, two, three, four, five, six. Right here. 
So I'll give a round of applause for Babe with the ones and twos behind the camera today. That kind of motivated me to get this video done for you guys today. We shot this video today and it's up to you today. So you motivated you. You motivated me. You motivated you. <laughs> you said, I'll get behind the camera. I was like, really? You sure? Because I wouldn't. <laughs> but this is an arm workout too. My trap, my trap, my right trap. Trap's hurting. My right trap. This the right one. All right, like I said, we got 50 frog jumps to end the workout. Hey man, you can get work done wherever you may be. You could be in the trenches, the cotton fields. You could be anywhere. There's always something around for you to get the work done you need for yourself to build yourself stronger. Now, I know I got all these old, these devices and equipment, but. Just because you have it is not an excuse to not get what needs to be done, done. Now, go on out there now. Put that work in I just did, and then do it again. Two days later, I got sweat in my eyes, so I'm, I keep closing them. <laughs> but, hey, you know what I need y'all for you? I need y'all to follow my Twitch channel, twitch.tv slash FB Aftermath. Could you do that for me? to the live streams. It's late. When I was a little boy, I wanted to be a hero. The truth is, when you get older, sometimes things don't always turn out the way you hoped they would. So you gotta do what you gotta do. Handle that business. Believe in yourself. Create your own destiny.